Well, if you watch tonight's game over on NBC Sports Network, I believe, mm -hmm. right? Yep. Uh, you already know that the entire broadcast crew, from the producers on down, were women. It's a first ever in U.S. sports broadcasting history, oh. and it coincides with International Women's Day. Now, these were ladies that have been around the game for a long time, every one of them. Uh, Mike Berman had a chance to talk with them about this first-time NHL event. It's eight hours before the Blackhawks face the Blues, which means it's eight hours before Kate Scott calls all the action for NBC Sports. As the longtime play-by-play -play announcer watches the Hawks go through their morning skate, she can't help but feel like she's about to be part of something special. It feels like an incredible honor to be here today. Kendall Coyne Schofield and A.J. Malesko will analyze the game. Both are currently analysts for NHL teams, and both have won gold medals with Team USA. So there isn't much they haven't seen or been a part of in the sport of hockey. But they also know this is no ordinary night at the rink. It's just extremely exciting, especially on International Women's Day. There are women in this business. The significance is that we've never all been on the same game together. Until tonight, on International Women's Day, when for the first time in United States history, an all-female crew broadcast an NHL game. From the studio to the booth to the ice, women made up every member of the on-air team. I just feel so grateful and lucky to have an opportunity that I didn't even know when I was training to be a broadcaster in college would be a possibility. It's the first time that the, the broadcast crew is all female. That's significant. It really is. And the game on NBC Sports Network didn't just feature females on the air. It featured them behind the scenes as well. Outside the UC, women produced and directed the game from inside this production truck. I've been in this industry for 20 years. I cover every sport there is, men's and women's soccer, college football, NFL. And this is the first broadcast where I'm going to have a female director and a female producer. So this is a big deal. The women on the microphones inside the UC want to make one thing clear. They weren't handed this opportunity. They earned it. All of us that are working tonight do this. It's not just me that does this every day, right? There are a lot of us that have experience. It's not their first time. It's not their first rodeo. It's just the first time all together. But that doesn't mean they're not grateful to have the chance to show young girls across the country that all their dreams are achievable. You need to see it to be it, as Billie Jean King always says, and I don't think that um, there's anything more true than that statement. This is something that maybe they want to do, maybe they don't want to do, but they know it's an opportunity and it's something available to them. I think tonight, hopefully, will give young girls who love this sport of hockey and young boys who love it too, an opportunity to see that if you have a passion for something and you want to do it, there's a chance that you can do it. At the United Center, Mike Berman, NBC5 Sports.